Guys, how's it hanging? How's it going? Oh, that's good. Awesome. That's great to hear. I don't really do this that often. I don't review cards that often that really don't pique my interest. But uh, this card, One Full Arrest, but I'll put it up soon. You'll see it in a minute. <coughs> it's a pretty cool card, actually. Uh, you might be seeing it in a whole lot of side deck options or even main deck to cert in a certain amount of cards. Uh, it's going to be released for us August 27th or something like that, but it's released this month at the OTG around April 25th or something like that. So you, let's get into it. It's a pretty cool card. It's a quick play spell card called Wrongful Arrest. It's already something that's really cool. Until the end phase of your next turn, so it's a quick play, so that you can activate the opponent's turn and still stays until the end of your turn, uh, until the end of the next turn. So, so for full turn and a half. Uh, players cannot add cards from the deck to their hand except by drawing them. So it's basically a mistake in a Thunder King in quick play spell card version. So hopefully, maybe we we'll, may see like a field card that probably does it, or because they brought out a quick play trap, a continuous trap, and there's a monster, which is Thunder King. And here's a second card that I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, it is Air Force. No, not Air Force. No, it's not Jordans. It's Air Force. It's actually called Chimpu no Baria. Air Force though. I'm trying to make it sound as Japanese as possible, I'm sorry. Um, it's a normal trap card, it's a secret ear, coming out also in Clash of Rebellions. All these cards that I'm, I'm talking about comes also out in Clash of Rebellions. <laughs> um, when an opponent declares an attack, when an opponent monster declares an attack, return all attack position monsters, your opponent's control to the hand. It's basically a mega compose. Go home. It's like, ah, I attack for game! Burp. Go home. Um, it doesn't, may not, the only other deck that it probably doesn't really work too well against is maybe Super Heavy Samurai, but who plays, who plays deck? <laughs> um, it's basically kind of the same way as a Mirror Force. I don't know if it's all too beneficial to send cards back to your opponent's hand. I don't think it's recommendable, but let's see how that goes, huh? The artwork is pretty, though. You know that feeling you get, right, when you activate a, like, Exciter Knight when you, or, no. Like, you know that feeling when you were just Exciter Knighted for, like, all your cards and shit, and then, and then you're like, well, damn, man, I'm done then. Well, here's a card called uh, Judgment Scales to fix all that problem. It's a normal trap card. It's a, it's a common, <laughs> right? Okay. A common you can activate judgment skills you can only activate one per turn but whatever care uh if there are more cards on your opponent's side of the field than you have on your field and in your hand combined draw cards equal to the difference <sighs> i have no words it's pretty good. <laughs> it's not super, super busted, but it's like, say for example, you're almost, if you're turn player or you're starting or whatever, yeah, you're turn player, you almost guarantee to always be minus one. You basically start with a minus one. You lose a card and say for example, you create an exceed. Uh, this helps a lot of like exceed decks, a lot of synchro decks and a lot of those type of decks that people like to play but always always lose on the the whole front of like oh i'm always minus one or i'm always minus two to, compared to my opponents who's probably either gonna drop a max c on me uh probably gonna stop my plays with like effect veiler and then like I'm, I'm done for the turn so hopefully this probably helps a whole lot of people who are behind but then don't forget it helps the people who are yeah it basically is a behind help card so i like it i like it a lot i like it a lot it's not bad this comes out also in clash right now, yes. so i hope you guys enjoyed this i hope you guys had fun i know i did um reviewing some of the other cards if any other cards that 
that piqued my interest so come with more, any more relevance for me so the three cards that i kind of liked so far and i'm really stoked to get these in august hopefully so hey satanic production be awesome stay awesome guys <laughs>